I did the morning show with uh, Keisha Nicole, Hatta, and Jess. I met Jess for the first time. She's so sweet. Hey, girl. Yes, Anaya, I miss you. I haven't seen you in probably I miss you too. two or three years. It's been it's been two. Damn, we're going on two years now. Wait a minute. Two yes, because the last time we seen each other, we were at um, Slim's party. Yes, the, at, at, at 713. You're right. Yes, that was two years ago, Jess. So we have a lot of catching up to do, of we course. Do. Obviously, we have a lot of music to talk about because it's yes. crazy at night. Why did you yes. go so crazy on side A? I don't understand. Like, why did you do that to us? Like, <laughs> you was back. I don't understand. Like, it was. Oh, it, stop. It ain't. It ain't all that. Nah, and side A is um. You know, side A is just that. Uh, let me get my mic. Is this thing on? Hello, people. Hi. Hi. How you doing today? Hey. Side A is like um, it's a taste of every emotion that we go through. You know what I mean? You got your ratchet club banger, which is peaches, mm -hmm. and then you have the the common question of of people that have no identification in a relationship with what are we? And then you got missing it when you in your fields and you want that old thing back, you know? <laughs> and then and then we have um, I just drew a blank. What's the other song on my album? H Town. I had to do one for my own city. You know what I mean? I had to represent for, for, for the home team. So it's a mixture of emotions on that record. Oh, my God. And I, okay, so wait. To rewind first. I have to congratulate you on your second bundle of joy. Thank you. So adorable. <laughs> Literally, like, I'm, I'm so, and you got right back to work, too. Like, I would just want to salute you for that because that, that is a huge well, thing. And I didn't really get right back to work. I took I took the time that I needed to take. You know what I mean? I had to. Um, I'm breastfeeding. I'm a breastfeeding mom. Yeah. So I had to. I had to take uh, the moment to just be with him and give him all of me because it's been yes. ten years since I had a baby girl. Ten okay. So, do you feel like it was it was it any easier the second time than the first time? Hell no. <laughs> more work this time around because I'm you know I'm older I'm not as energetic I don't have as much you know like being up and, and alert all the time you know things things yeah. start to die down when you get a little age on you so with this baby um I feel like it's requiring so much more of me than my first one Austin was easy like I just used to throw clothes on him and send him outside he was an easy <laughs> kid but this new one he's it's I'm I'm having to learn how to be a mommy all over again if that makes sense you know he's more attention Definitely. He's spoiled. But both of my babies are spoiled. <laughs> oh, and they're so, so cute, too. Thank you, girl. You said that you kind of took a break. So, like, did you do side A before? So, I did I did side A while I was pregnant. People okay. don't know this, but the entire, my entire pregnancy, I worked. I, I'm uh, Kenny Hamilton, my manager now. He, um, you know, he didn't look at me being pregnant as a crippling thing. If anything, he he told me it was more of a drive for me to get out there and do what I need to do. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I was shooting videos and recording and doing twelve hour sessions and but I was I was working working with that belly. You hear me? Yes, yes. Working, and I, working. Also, when you shot Peaches, that was your first time after you had the baby that you were on camera and stuff. Back so, on camera doing well, another video. After like, you about it or were you like you know? I, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be 100% open and honest with you right now, sis. I had I had so many reservations. I didn't feel like my body. You know, I've I've told you before. I've always had this. You know, this this thing about me and my body. I've always struggled with my weight, and it took me a long time to find that chunky girl confidence that I had. You know, to my yeah. And then here I am now. Just had a baby, and I'm back to square one. So now all over again. I feel like. My tummy, oh, my tummy too big. Or make sure you get the, like, we had to shoot. We had to stop and shoot a few times because it was some of them angles I wasn't feeling. Like, now, nah, y'all, I don't like how my side belly looking. You see them double chins and you, it took, it was a process. It was a process shooting peaches. <laughs> For sure. But peaches is fire, honestly. 
Peaches Thank you, fire. Mama. Fallen is fire too. The whole project. Fire. Wait, so wait, we got to back it up, back it up too, because you and Jay are effing adorable. Like that's I, my baby. I, that's ba y'all are so cute together. That's my baby. I love. Shout it to the rooftops. I love the way. How did y'all? Jay, Jay, where's Jay? First of all, how did y'all meet? And I like where you find him at? We got everybody trying to find a Jay now. Oh, she don't want to say. Wait, not the DMs. Now, nah, girl. Um. <laughs> so what had happened was, um. Now nah, I'm just saying because it's it's already out on our YouTube page. We talked about it in depth on our page. Mm -hmm. I actually met Jay at my baby daddy house. I know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, no, no. Rewind. Was... Bring that back. <laughs> I say I met Jay. At my baby daddy house. <laughs> and now you're the biggest boss. Honestly, you're the biggest boss. Look, you go. You go hey. Because you, you and Jay, y'all are Listen, everybody. when love finds you, you you, you go with the flow. It, nah, seriously, though, it was a... um. It was my son's dad's house. He's He was roommating with um someone that has that's a mutual friend of Jay and I. Uh -huh. So I actually was getting ready to leave. But then Jay walks in, and I was like, I think I'm going to stay. <laughs> <laughs> and we got the rapping, and that's how it happened, OK? Oh, my god. So what, what, what? Did, was, was baby daddy cool with it by any chance? Or like, oh. Uh, he ain't had no choice but to me. Oh, OK, OK. So he don't, it, it's OK, it's OK, it's OK. It ain't got nothing to that's do with whether he happy so with it or not. Tis what it is, OK? <laughs> Jay, we are wrapped up into this thing. And I know I saw you guys started the YouTube page, too. What made y'all want to start a YouTube together? Yes. Because was my <laughs> Just because, you know, Jay's from Jamaica. Mm -hmm. He's um he's really he's a really quiet person, but he has such a funny personality. And I told him, you know, I was like, baby, you should get out of your shell more. Like, I would love to share you with my fans. I would love to share you with this world that I'm that I'm in. You know what I mean? So... <laughs> He stepped outside the box for me because he's not. Jay is mean, girl. He is not. No a way. Person. He is mean. <laughs> he is no, he does not seem mean. Well, okay, I won't say mean, but he's just not like. He don't he's be not like an outgoing person that's gonna be like, "Hey, everybody, come on, party at my place. Come over here." That's me. Right. And he. He. You know. But opposites attract. You know what I mean? How long has he been here since Jamaica? He's been here for some years. Jay's oh. been in the States since he was a teenager. Yeah. Oh. And he goes back and forth to visit his family. And I'm going to Jamaica to meet my mother-in-law this Christmas, girl. And I'm so excited. Yay! It's going to be my first time in Jamaica. I'm really, really excited. Are you taking the babies? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. My mother-in-law wants to meet um, the baby. She hasn't had a chance to embrace him. So it's going to be a, a learning experience for all of us. Like, we get to see the culture up close and personal. I'm going to every party on every block in every hood. And and I'm eating every meat patty and smoking every joint. I don't give a damn. I'm doing it all, girl. As you said, you deserve it. You really deserve Thank it. Thank you, Jazzy. No. I'm so proud of you, too. Okay. Just like, stop. Let's give it up for you, though. Because you work on... No. No, 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 no. This woman cursed Wednesday. We got to give you your flowers while you're here, girl. You're doing your damn thing, Jazz. I'm proud of you, mama. For I'm real. Trying. I'm trying. Look, putting on for other people is the best thing that I could possibly do. So that's yes. all I can do over here. Yes. And also, I saw Anaya, your last flashcard freestyle. Anaya, like, <laughs> what? how you be like, you? I know you've been, you've been, you're not new to this. You've truly been doing this, but how, yeah. bro? How did you learn how to? You know, you know, Jazzy, you know, I hadn't. I hadn't been in that element because I've been in mommy mode for so long and nothing wrong with that. It's, it's, I'm not saying there's anything wrong with that because I, I love my babies to death, but I, I hadn't found a space yet of being a mommy and still tapping into my artistry. Mm -hmm. So I, I literally kind of was at a standstill for a second. And I, I even went through a period of writer's block. I ain't gonna lie. And postpartum kicked my ass. For real? I had a hard time with postpartum. Yes, girl. This is the stuff that people don't know. This is the stuff that the artists don't talk about. You know what I mean? Right. Um, postpartum was really tough for me. I was really stressed. Oh, I'm getting emotional. Wait. Go ahead, Anaya. I already know. Look, you are the, you are a <laughs> bad 
bitch, you out here, <laughs> badass woman. Literally, somebody commented, motherhood and music balance. Like, people not doing that, Aya. You are back. Like, Girl. Like, you never even left. I just want to give you your your credit and your love for that because that is one, that's the funniest thing you could possibly in this yeah, life. Yeah, yeah. Postpartum was, was tough. I didn't, I didn't, um, I couldn't find a space to still get into myself lyrically and still dedicate myself to my boys. So... This was my, this was me giving it a try. And I told my sister, I was like, sis, I got to give my fans what they know of me. I got to, I got to, I got to come back. Like this is, this hiatus is over. This is done. <laughs> so she was like, well, what you want to do, sister? I'll help you whatever way I can. I said, okay, just write some words down for me. And I'm going to just try to just like, I don't know, freestyle about them. So she, she sat here and wrote some words down for me. And I was just like, okay, let's give it a shot. <laughs> that's how you really got started getting out of your writer's block yeah today was my first time out of back out of my writer's block from oh this my morning. yes girl from this morning with at the morning show with um with keisha j mack and jess and then i came home and i you know i have like this newfound energy from being at the station today and i was like sister i want to let me get back. Let me try, you know. So shout out to Nine Seven Nine for helping me get back into yes. my bag, you know. Yes. Yes. We are out here, to back out here. We are so nine for yes, real. Is. Yeah, so today was the first time. Keep dropping the freestyles on our head top, all that stuff. Look, the one you sure. did over that Bobby Cadwell song on YouTube. Oh my yeah. god. Oh, oh my. yeah. Oh, classic. Yeah. If you're gonna mess with a classic, you better do it. And you better do it right. You understand what I'm saying? Oh, nice. For real. Do on side A, like all the, the samples that you use. Like, I'm like, yeah. where did you get up with this? Like, so tell me about like when you were creating side A, like what time span was that? Like, how long did it take you to put that project together? I want to say side A was like side A was sort of a, 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 a in and out thing. Um, I, I like I said, I worked through like the first five months of my pregnancy, all up on all the way up until seven months mm -hmm. I was recording. Mm -hmm. So with side A, I went in and I was like, okay, I want to, I want I need to be able to touch all of these different types of moves while I'm sitting out with this baby. I want to have something for the club. I want to have something for the people that's going through relationship issues. I want to have something for the, for the confident girls. Like I just, I needed to touch each emotion with that record because I wanted something to sit and, and, and be with the people while I was on my maternity leave. So that's what I accomplished with side A girl. You kept us busy. We still busy listening to it, and I am running it back. Yes. Over. Look, they talking about I'm listening to Peaches right now. <laughs> so I said, okay, DJs, okay, the DJs. Yes, girl. I'm really Anaya, excited about what are we because I said, hold on, Anaya. This yeah. is the spoken question. I thought yeah. you're not supposed. To, I thought you're not supposed to ask that question. Well, here's the thing. So many of us, men and women. We've been in that relationship where we be, we're committed all by ourselves. We in love all by ourselves. So at, at some point, you, you realize you have all of this time invested mm -hmm. and all of this good loving invested. Mm -hmm. At some point, you need an answer. So what, what, we, what are we doing? What is this? What, what are we? What, what's up? You know what I'm saying? So I wanted to touch that because it's such an unspoken topic. Exactly. I was like, yeah. Hold on a second. So what do you think, what do you think in your opinion, like when it comes to relationships and stuff, when can you ask that song? Like, when can you ask that question? Like, at what point are you like, you know what? We doing enough to where. So I'm not one of the people that put, I'm not one of the people that use time as the, the. Marker. Yeah. As the marker of a relationship. Cause I'm, I'm one of those people that believe in love at first sight because I, I fell in love with Jay at first sight. So I'm, I'm, that's me. That's, that's the type of person I am. Mm -hmm. So I would say if it's gotten to a point to where you feel like your heart is in that thing, like deep in that thing to the point to where if you sit in with somebody else, it's going to bother you. That's when you need to kind of put it on the table. Like, hold on. Cause what, Wait, what you're not going to do, <laughs> what you're not going to do is I saw you walk up in here with her, but me and you was together day before yesterday. We can't have that. We cannot right. have Absolutely. When it start bothering you, that's when you need to. That's when you need to bring up the bring up the topic for sure. That's right. Guys, whenever it starts bothering you, go ahead. Yeah, ask yeah. I'm gonna ask you about the Houston song because so hard. Like I love listening, riding in the city, listening to it, and you got Scarface on it. How did y'all like? How did that? How did you get him on it? Like the listen, oh. you got to be. You gotta be. I say you gotta be some kind of special. Sing it, yes. 
to yes. get Scarface to come out, to come back out and bless your record. I didn't even, I'm going to tell y'all something. I didn't even think he was going to do it. Really? I didn't think I was worthy enough. I didn't think I was big. I didn't think my name was big enough. I didn't, I just didn't feel like I was worthy of, of thou greatness. You know <laughs> what I mean? So yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, my a &R, Tina Davis, who always looks out for me, she has my best interest at heart. I love her so much. Shout out to um, Tina Davis at Empire. She's really good friends with him. Um, so she gave him a phone call and it was like, hey, this is my baby girl. She's she's my new artist. Um, she's a big fan of yours. She would love, to, you know, if you could bless the track. Even with him going through what he's what he's dealing with right now. Yeah. And, and blessings to him. His son just gave him a whole hey. kidney. Wow. That's what I'm saying. So for him to be going through that and still find the time to get on my record and not me, I, I, girl, listen, I have no words. I told that man I'm forever indebted to you, my G. Like, you get so much, he gets so much respect from me. Whether he would have did it or not, I still would have understand understood the situation that he was dealing with, you know? Legendary. Nice. Legendary man, legendary. Both, although, don't be just both of y'all. Like both of y'all are legends, literally. Nah, not For yet. No, nope. not yet, Jazzy. I'm, I'm trying to get there, but I, I ain't a legend yet, man. No, I'm telling you, Anaya. I'm not here to cap. I don't cap. I don't have the time for that. Anaya side ain't going crazy. <laughs> crazy. <laughs> I gotta ask you about Woody too, because the sample. Oh, now, yeah. How did you come up with the the name Woody for that song? I mean, I figured, but I need to ask. Okay, I mean, okay, because I because you know you know, you know what I'm saying. Never mind. <laughs> Woody, the is, Woody is one of those confident records where you you know you know you got you know you got something that homie need. You know you got something that homie want, and he been looking all night for this hit. Hey. Yeah. So I think I think with Woody, I just tap. Like I said, I wanted to tap into all of those emotions and all of those moods that I know I've been in up mm -hmm. until you know getting pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, I can still have sex while you're pregnant. Y'all, maybe this is TMI, but you can still have sex when you're pregnant. Is this thing on? Hey, hey. yes, you can. Si se puede. Hey. Si se puede. <laughs> yes, we can. <laughs> all all the way up to, all the way up to the to the end though. Listen, it helps get that baby out into the world, honey. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Absolutely. <laughs> Flip it up, smack it down, turn it around. I love you. Yes, girl. You're so wild. I love you. What's, <laughs> um, what's the next video you have, too? Do you have any more videos coming for Side A? So, right now, Side A, the project for Side A has been completed. Right now, I'm moving on to Side B. I'm super, super excited about Side B, man. Hopefully, with this with this project, I'm going to have some of the features that I've always wanted, always wanted to work with. So, Toby is one of the biggest... I'm such a fan of Toby, man. Every time I see this dude, I be trying to, like, not fan. I, I be trying to be cool. Like, I just seen him two weeks ago at uh, one of our friend's comedy shows. Mm -hmm. I was like, hey, Toby, how you doing? <laughs> I gave him a hug. And he was like, oh, Cam, you ain't tell me a night he was going to be out here. I was like, oh, he's saying my name so casually like we're friends. <laughs> um, I definitely want to work with Toby, but he he knows that. I've, I've, I've voiced it before. Mm -hmm. um, definitely want to get in with uh, Bryson Tiller. You know what I'm saying? Oh I'm a big God. fan of Bryson's pen. Yeah, girl. There's this artist named Buddy from Cali. Definitely want to work with Buddy. I just I have my my list is so long, Jazz, that when I get back to LA, I'm I'm touching I'm touching a lot of people. Absolutely. I'm excited. So, so side B is in the works now still. Definitely. Side B is in the works. But very it's gonna be more feature focused. Definitely. Yeah, this time around. It's time. It's time. I think I've proved my ability to uh, you know, do what I do what I can on a track by myself. I Absolutely. think it's time to work well with friends, work well with others. So, yeah. Do we have a, Do we have a tentative uh, like period that you are like we gonna get it before the end of this year? That's I don't say. got a date, but I'm gonna tell you what: when it do drop, it's gonna be well worth the wait. I promise that. I promise you that for sure. And Naya, yeah. wait, wait a minute. I'm scared though because. When somebody say worth the wait, I'm like, a year or nine? Hold on a second. Hold on. No, no, because you got to understand, I've already taken my break, Jazz. I had a baby. I took that I took that seven months off. We had quarantine. The shutdown is, like, I'm. it's enough of that. I've had enough of a break. It's time to get back to work, my girl. We're For outside. sure. We're yeah. Wow, and I'm so proud of yeah. you. I I'm love you so much. Thank you, Sissy. Thank you so <laughs> much. I listen to Saturday. I called everybody. I knew. I'm like, bitch, Anaya. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, j Mag, I said, what is going on? I'm like, what is going on? Like, we have yes. flowers now, all of them. Yes. 
Yes, girl. And as good as as good as side A is doing, you know what? People still they still have I still have the biggest support with Best Thing. Best Thing is my biggest record. Absolutely. And people they just it just it has a it keeps on giving, man. It has a life of its own and it won't die. Best thing won't die. It's definitely gonna be one of those timeless classics that last forever. For sure. And also I have to ask you, how did you get Frida on the remix too? Oh, Frida is my sister. That's saw- my big sister. I first met like that was like two years ago yes you remember oh you remember that when she came and did the show yeah and I, I told all of my followers i was like y'all big frida coming to town i need everybody to tag up i was i was dead ass serious i was like y'all big frida coming to town y'all don't play with me if y'all say y'all love me like y'all do i need everybody to tag her and tell her i want to meet her when she get here yes. and they did and they did and then i called uh my homegirl super super scent from crayon case yes. who's cousins with frida Yes. So along with the help of my annihilators and Frida, I was able to uh, get tickets to the show, or not tickets, but I was able to get backstage and, and meet her and see the show and everything. And then she was like, come in my dressing room. I was like, you want me to come in the dressing room? Girl, and then she asked me to sing and freestyle. She put me on the spot and I was like, I'm going to do whatever, what you want? What you want me to sing? Baby? What you, you want to cook for you too? I do whatever you want me to do. I love Frida, man. Her energy is just so... The same way y'all see her online is the same way she is in real life. You're never going to get a different version of Frida. I love Frida. Hey, sissy. Frida is fine. So ever since then, y'all was just tight, and then that's how. Yeah, it's a, it's a whole relationship now, man. That's that's my big sister, for real. Everything, for sure. Yeah, yeah. Just filled with joy and life. I'm so happy that you are out to talk to, and you are ready. Like, listen, Anaya, it is your time, and we are here. I cannot wait. Don't make me cry, Jazz. I'm trying to be gangsta. <laughs> We are not gangster women. We cry too. We showing all our sides. Just we like that. We, <laughs> shit. we falling in love with it. We asking questions. We are smoking. We Facts. 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 Oh my God. I love you. And I'm so proud of you too. Again, Thank keep you so doing much. your thing, sissy. I'm very Thank proud you of you. So- I will see you very soon, hopefully in person too. And we will be able to do something again because I feel yeah, like I'm for sure. Over here, yeah, we're gonna link up soon for sure. For real, okay. I miss you. We will have a All great right, baby girl. Be safe, you too. Bye, love you.